In this video, we're going to learn how to import athletes from an external drive from Excel or from Numbers or whatever program you have to be able to add a lot of athletes at once. To do this, we go to the Management area, which is the tab all the way to the right. We click on Athletes, and we click on the plus sign to view our options. We have several options. In this video, we're going to see the one that has to do with the TSV or downloading a template. The first thing we're going to do is click on TSV, and we get two options. They are to import a file from your Files folder or from Documents, or download a template from the web. This last option is the one we saw before to download a template. What we're going to do now is go to the computer to show you how to download the template on the computer and fill it out, and how to come back here, click on Files, and load the file we've filled out. The first thing we have to do is go to our web page, vtruve.fit, and click on the Teams area. Here what we're going to do is scroll down to this area here where it says manage all your athletes at once. And we click here where it says download template. Okay, now that we have it downloaded, we open it. And it will open with the program we have set by default, whether that be Excel or Numbers. In this case, what I have is Numbers, so I'm going to open it. Okay, now we have it here, and the first thing we have to do is set it up before we input the data. The first thing is whether we want to input the data with periods or commas, which depends on the country. Some countries use commas, and other countries use periods. Then the date format, the same. We write a 1 or a 2, depending on whether we want this format or this format. Then the weight format for the athlete's weight, the same. If we want to use kilograms, we write a 1 here. If we want to use pounds, we would write a 2. And the same for the height format of the athlete. We would write a 1 if we're going to use centimeters, or a 2 if it's going to be in feet. Okay, and we follow the same pattern these examples have. These two athletes we had here, you can just erase them because they're just there as an example. And then you can start introducing your athletes. The only mandatory information is just the first and last names, just like in the app. I'm going to do a few more so you can see. For example, I'm going to write an email. Just make one up. I'm just going to write example two to distinguish them. I'm also going to input the weight and create another athlete. And I'm inputting the weight, really, because later it will appear in the app. All right. Once you've filled everything out, here it would be the same as up here. For the gender, just write a 1 for male, 2 for female, 3 for other. Okay, now we have these three athletes. Let's imagine these are all the athletes we want to use. What we want to do then is save. We go to File and Export as a TSV. We want to save it as a TSV or export it as a TSV file. We save it, for example, to the desktop. And now we have it here. Now what we want to do with this file is pass it over to the device we're going to use, tablet, iPhone, whatever we're using, whether that be through email, WhatsApp web, AirDrop if you have a Mac, in this case, since the fastest and easiest way is to use AirDrop, that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to open AirDrop. Here it is. Here's my iPad. I'm going to send it to the iPad. OK, there's the file on the tablet. And I'm just going to accept it. 
and save it, the easiest thing to do would be to save it to files. On our iPhone, files, documents, on our iPhone or tablet. So once we've sent it to our device, we select it and save it to files. Okay, now we're back in the app and we go to the management area, which is the tab all the way to the right. We click on athletes and add athletes. And we're going to select TSV. Now we have to select the folder we've saved the file to, which in this case would be the files folder. We select the folder and search for the file we just saved and we click on it. And we and here are the three athletes we just created on our computer. Now we've seen how to import athletes from a TSV that we generated on our computer, which we filled out and then sent to our device. Now what we're going to see is the same process, but done entirely on the tablet without using a computer. This process is a little more simple, but entering the athletes can be a little more cumbersome. We prefer the computer because it's easier to manage and then just send it to your device. But this is a valid option as well. We're going to click up here to the right and download the template. And we always save it to files. Her actually remember where you save it to because it doesn't matter as long as you remember. I'm going to save it here in numbers. Save, and now what we have to do is go to files. Here it is. We open it, and our file should be here. Here it is. Now, for this part, you absolutely have to have the numbers app. If not, it won't work because when we click on the file, the numbers app will open automatically because it is the app that can read this type of file. And here we have the same TSV file as on the computer. This is the default template. As I mentioned earlier, you have to input these numbers. And here you would enter your athletes. You have to hit edit first to edit. And then here you would import their data. And you can enter as many athletes as you want. You just need to make more rows and enter more athletes. I'm just going to use these two athletes it comes with for the example. And when you're ready, when you're done entering athletes, you click on the three dots. You click on export as a TSV file. And you export as a TSV file. And save it, in this case, in the same folder. But as I said before, it doesn't matter where you save it to as long as you remember. Here we're going to write a different number, for example, 3, so we remember which file it is. We just hit Save. OK. Now that we have it saved, here we should have this one, the one we just created. We go back to the app, and we import the file just like before. TSV, Files, and here it is, the one we just created. If we did it right, here we should have the two default athletes we just created through TSV.